Hey everybody, here I am again, out in the sing down rain. Yeah, I decided to uh, come and do a little bit of carp fishing and uh, I must be fair here, I've not got wet as such yet, I've got a brolly. Um, it's, I don't have a fox shelter or anything like that, I wish I did now. <laughs> But, um, yeah, I got a couple of decent uh, carp reels off a fella the other day. 20 quid for the two. Um, he wanted 10 to start off with, and then as I got there, he realised they were worth a lot more money than that. Anyway, um, yeah, I think it's about £10 line on there. I've got a carp rig set up on it using a few boilies which is something I've never actually done I've never carp fished before um, there are carp in here um, quite big ones at times I know people that have caught big carp so yeah me in my ultimate wisdom because it was sunny when I came out oh yes let's go down the river and do a bit of fishing today because I've, I've been off for a week and I've got another week and a bit to go before I start a new job um, in the same line that I was doing before, working in a builder's yard, selling building materials, um, just with a different branch. Can we name names? Yeah, sorry, we can name names. I'm going back to Tucson's. Um, I was with a company called MKM, uh, and they weren't my cup of tea. I can honestly say that. I've been with them for a year, and it was really hard work really hard work so I've gone back to a, a company I know and trust um, money's a tiny little bit better um, and it's not far away from where I live so a little bit easier to, to get to in the mornings I'm looking forward to it I must admit I really am actually looking forward to it they look a nice bunch of guys there and girls there's a lady that works in the yard as well which is good um, I like this equal stuff Anyway, I decided to come down here today and do a bit of carp fishing. I've only actually been down here an hour or so, and it has absolutely started to hammer it down. Do you think I'm going to have any luck? I don't know. Do you know what? I had a bite a moment ago, and I didn't have the free run on, and I think it's probably taken my boilie off. I've, I say, I've never used them before. They're a bit fiddly to get on the old hooks. Um, I've never carp fished before. So for me this is a new a new thing. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna give up, I'm gonna persist in this weather for another hour or two and see how we go. As I say, I haven't actually got wet as such yet, but it has got quite heavy now. Um, the brolly seems to be more behind me in front of me, so I'm gonna sort that out in a moment. So I'm getting a better coverage. Unfortunately, the pole I found to tie it to wasn't too hot. In fact, this isn't too hot, what I'm sitting on, but there you go. Well, we'll see. I'd love to be on that boat over there, Frodo. Um, I'd have a nice TV set up in there, and God knows what, you could go to sleep on there. It'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Eh? Absolutely adorable. I know it's a bit dirty. I think the bloke's there, he's cleaning it all up. I've al always liked that boat, always. It is actually a sailing boat, but he's taken the sail off and everything. Oh, I think it would be better just to run it like that as a, as a motor launch. Um, you don't need sails. You don't want sails, do you? It's a load of hard work, that. Uh, anyway, yeah, so... It's an absolutely miserable day now. It was beautiful when I started out. And those people will come back for that motor launch over there in a moment. That one, right there. They've gone to the pub behind me. I think they wanted to tie up here, but I wouldn't tie a boat up here. Because it isn't this sturdy, it isn't that sturdy, this timber I'm on. I can honestly say that, it's not sturdy at all. In fact, I'm surprised I haven't ended up floating down the river. 
but I haven't yet, so anyway. Now, what do you think, guys? Should I carry on with this and keep trying my luck? Uh, which doesn't seem to be there at the moment, but uh, I, I think we should carry on. I'm gonna carry on for a while. I'm gonna pull it in in a moment, see what the bait side of it looks like. I might try a little bit of sweet corn or something. Um, bigger hooks than what I'm used to using. I always use tiny hooks and normally catch decent size uh, bream and things like that. But this season so far, apart from a couple of tiny little things, I've caught absolutely bugger all. Um, but you have to persist. You have to persist in this uh, game. Otherwise... Um, if you caught every time you went out there, it would probably get boring. Uh, anyway, I am going to carry on. I'm going to carry on and see how we go with it. Yeah, there's some lovely old boats along there. I'd really, really love a boat. Every time I look at them, I think I'd love a boat. Especially one with a little cabin on it or something. So you, can, if it's horrible like this, you can pull over put the telly on for a bit or whatever and uh, just chill out I think that would be quite nice and it's a lovely river here it's a bit overgrown a bit wild and woolly but you can go right up there right down there you can go all the way to Sandwich down that end and all the way up to Fordwich in Canterbury that way maybe a bit further up I don't know I'm not sure not having a boat, I couldn't tell you. But, uh, yeah, I think it's um, it's something I would love to do. Um, and not just from the fishing side of it. I'd enjoy going up and down. And I would actually use it, whereas most of these people don't. These boats do not move. They've sat there and sat there and sat there. In fact, that one there, that Molly M, that, um, that sank um, not so long back, where it had been left for so long, the water all got in the back, and then it was a high tide, and she sank. And they got her out, and they sorted it out, but, uh, yeah. But most of them, yeah, they only they spend millions of pounds on these boats, and take them out up the river, get something to eat and go back again. I really don't think that's what it's all about. I think there's a little bit more to it than that. You've got to, in, you've got to be able to enjoy it, not just, not just do that. It don't seem right to me. Anyway, let's uh, get back to the, the line. Well, nothing's happening. I'm going nowhere real fast. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put you guys down. Well, I say put you down. I'm going to switch you off for a moment. And I'm going to move my brolly to a slightly better place and move myself. Because I say, I'm not getting wet, but I'm just starting to get a tad wet. Because it, it, it's more behind me than um, in front of me. So I'm going to move that about and have a play about. I say I'm not going to give up yet. I'm going to carry on for a little while. Uh, and the fish are under the water. It don't matter to them whether it's raining, I don't think. I don't know. Does it? Do they go, oh, it's raining, let's not come out? I don't think so. Um, yeah. So anyway, guys, thank you for all your, your views and everything. Um, last one was i did a motorbike one um i will do some more motorbike ones um i have been using the bike a little runs here and there um but i haven't actually i haven't got another project yet or anything like that maybe you should put this to the boat guys do you think i should try and pick up an old boat and have that as a project next i've never done that uh, uh, boat project and I can film it and uh, then when we get it up and running with an engine and what have you we can uh, do some filming up and down the river 
have a vote for me guys um, the, how are we going to do this the, the more uh, thumbs up I get um, for, for yes get a boat and uh, take it up down the river I'm sure I can pick an old vessel up something old do it up that would be fun that would make some good footage some good fun footage so yeah put it to the boat guys anyone that thinks I should get a boat tart it up I've done camper vans and things like that in the past so thumbs up for a yes if, if you want to, want me to pick up an old boat of some description and we'll go up and down the river once we've done it up but there'll be some fun footage doing it up and some fun footage going up and down the river anyway guys I'm going to say bye for now love you lots all of you and have an absolutely excellent day don't get wet like me and I'll say bye for now <laughs>